a sweet science to boxing the there's a sweet science to boxing the The best and the coolest thing about my career is called the sweet science. There's a sweet science to boxing the It's to hit and not get hit. This is Saul Canelo well, Alvarez. Winning by knockout is always wonderful, right? So I think that I'm gonna win by knockout before the eighth round. Let's get to it. So you guys already know about your boy Canelo. Got a fight coming up with Heyman Mangia this Saturday, May the 4th. Now, Canelo made a bold claim after the press conference. He said that he will knock out Heyman Mangia in under eight rounds. You know what I, what, I, what I do. Do I believe him? I definitely believe him. And I'm going to tell you why I believe him. Canelo knew what he was doing. He knows exactly what he's doing on why he's fighting Heyman Mangia. Why do you think he sounds so confident when he said that? Because he is confident that he's going to knock out Heyman McGill. He know Heyman McGill ain't never fought no fighter like him. He knows this. Heyman McGill like, haven't made any noise at 168. He knows this. Heyman McGill hasn't even been in danger of a fighter like Canelo. I mean, the only thing he's really done is fought people Canelo have already beaten. Like Leon Smith and John Ryder. But he hasn't been in the hot waters. Canelo knows that. You see, Canelo has multiple times. And he's persevered. Well, two times he didn't, but most times he did. See, here's the thing. We know the style that Hammer McGill got. He's come forward, pressure, power. Canelo have fought people like that before. Hammer McGill, he ain't never fought a fighter like Canelo, but Canelo have fought somebody like Hammer McGill multiple times. I can give you one fighter if you're wondering. Triple G. I know some of you guys are probably saying, Triple G style is not like Hammer McGill's. Well, technically, he has come forward, pressure, with power. Some will say he may even have more power than Heyman McGill, given the fact that he had a 88% knockout ratio, and Heyman McGill got a, what, 79% knockout ratio? Canelo fought Triple G three times. You think he can't handle Heyman McGill? He's handled fighters like that before. That's why he knew what he was doing. That's why a lot of people haven't even really been covering this fight. So yeah, I agree with Canelo. I believe that he will knock him out in under eight rounds. You see when Canelo said, this, this Canelo, Canelo, nobody, nobody can beat this Canelo. this Canelo. He wasn't talking about people like David Benavidez or Terrence Crawford or David Morrell. He wasn't talking about those type of guys. He was talking about guys like Heyman McGill, guys like Jamil Charlo, John Ryder. Those are the guys he was talking about. But I agree with Canelo and I definitely believe he's going to be knocking out Heyman McGill in under eight rounds.